Hello guys, it's Mungai Eve. Welcome to the Mungai Eve show. And of course, we're the number one online TV show. Na leo ni kona amazing, amazing guest with me. Juzi ni mekua na Babji. Waka request sana, sana. Nitafte Boogie. That is Kenny. Nitafte Fatso. And that's why ni meleta Boogie. Uko aje? Niko fiti sana. Eh. Tuluko tunokuwa na ngukua katoto. Usha fika izi za niko fiti sana. Anyway, just a joke. Kuko poa? Niko fiti sana, man. Uh-huh. Yeah. Life ina kupeleka ju? Life ina nipeleka tu. Uh-huh. Yeah. Tuna, tuna move na pesi yake. Uh-huh. Yeah. Tuna ngangana. Tuna That's na. what we say, kwetu. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, Boogie, tungetaka kuru the way back okay. uh, from Machachari. You know, most of us tukiona EFES tuna kumbuka nga machachari yeah. by then ulikuwa tunakujua kama Kenny yeah. kama mtu kama mimi ukadhani hiyo jina yako kukuja ku realize jina yako ni jipata mimi ni mjinga yeah. <laughs> but anyway tungetaka kujua safari yako ya machachari how did you find yourself there kwa machachari mm. so i think nili nili join machachari around 2011 12 yeah mm-hmm. 12 same 12 um so nilikuwa na kuzo yangu he was a close family friend so mimi tatu kuzo yangu ni to deno tuli grow up na langata estate moja so okay na deno moved to kwa sky and when they moved um unajua tukiwa watu hii definitely uh, machachari liko everything like hey, kila mtu kila mtu liko nataka kuwa tu machachari you know mm. kuona hawa si kuona hawa so when deno moved to kwa sukari uh, their house was ilikuwa like a few meters from set ya matachari ile nyumba ya kina almasi mm-hmm. then i came to find out yo ndio like yo ndio pale wase ukama so kama hapo yo ndio location yo ndio nini so they know alikuwa anaenda huko wana chill kwa hiyo keja ana 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 ka machines kadha na kam kam nikamuona siku moja kwa tv nikampigia nikamwambia deno una ini nyumba ya kina almasi eh eh so nika nika organize nikamwambia madhangu ni aje mimi na dai kwenda kwa kina deno holiday mm. so tulikuwa tunishi langata au ni chika sky mm. so madhangu akaniambia definitely tu madhangu ni mode so akaniambia ai kwa unataka kwenda holiday kwa rafiki yako mm. lazima upass mm. eh au kwa exam ya mwisho mm. eh kwanza jumode wangu alikuwa mode wa kiswahili nikangangana na kiswahili <laughs> kagangana then I, uh, fortunately nika like aliona two effort and i passed mm. and then akanipeleka huko for holiday so when i was there to kind the first time na deno the mm-hmm. second time but even when at when did i know i used to wake up very early mm-hmm. kwenda kunokio gate mm. oh, ni aje mm mimi nataka ku act so nilikuwa na time nikiona maktas wameenda around 5 pm wame rap yeah. so nilikuwa naona naumi kamao na kulikuwa na madam anaitwa wanga tukamtwa anti wanga mm-hmm. so nikiwa na anti wanga na time sh nenda na knock mm-hmm. so siku moja wanga akafungua akaniambia aje ebu 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 jaribu ku act oh there was a time ulikuwa yeah. unaenda pale na una, una knock maybe ndo kuna kwa some say so obvious watu wake 50 wame knock kwa hiyo gate <laughs> so no me i could do like ah sawa 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 sa. but then nikaanza kwa mset na deno ni ni nini kufanya ma extra roles then wanga de moja tu akani akani audition tu hapo random mm. kaniambia ni aje eh huko sawa tutakuita tutakuita tukiwa na auditions mm. so nikarudi home na by then ulikuwa how old ilikuwa i think 11 11 ama 12 nikarudi mm-hmm. home mm-hmm. wa wow. nilingoja 8 months <laughs> for a call 8 months <laughs> madangu hadi alikuwa na jam the first month kila week nilikuwa na call wanga kila week then nikaenda after hadi madangu ana jam Ulikosha mwa, ulikosha mbia mama. kuna deal. Kuna deal moto. Inaiva. <laughs> Inaiva. <laughs> But madangu alikuwa anaona tu ni jokes ni nini. Ni. Mm. Then siku moja wanga tu akapiga usiku fulani. Akapigia mamaangu akamwambia ni aje. Hadi mamaangu ajui wanga ni nani. After 8 months. Eh, nani wanapigia mtoto wangu usiku kumuuliza kuhusu mtoto wangu akamwambia ni aje. Mimi naitwa wanga re eh, na call on behalf of nini matachare ni mama keni ye yeah, tunataka mtoto wako anaweza patikana kesho tuzana saa tu kuja auditions yeah. so ni kendo auditions kwa auditions watu 15 for one role mm. kwa like wow. na by then uliko na kuna kuanga na hizo auditions unajua no, umetoa mbe uliko na knocking kwa mlango mm, ni kama you thought hey, mimi nilikuwa nilikuwa from the word go nili realize napenda acting sana mm. nikaanza ku treat ka career na nika make decision mm. in your career yangu that's why nili nili go 
all in to make sure nimepata i think i'm the most stubborn person na umika mao ama wanga ashaipata na naye cuz nilingangana nilingangana hadi waka wakakubali cuz ningo mka nilikuwa naenda zingine ma extracts ka extra ma church scenes na jaza tu hapo natoka hivi scene moja we na kufa nayo nikifika hivi choto niambia tulikuwa na tulikuwa na kwamba chachari kwa ile scene ya chachu ki ukifanya fanya hivi naambia ni mimi deal moto inakuja deal moto so nilije push nilije push then we did the auditions i remember me doing the auditions and after tufanye auditions nilo audition ni na Martin Gidinje uh, after the audition i remember me shooting the same day mm-hmm. like nilo audition asubuhi after na kwa manager chock pair role mm-hmm. for costuming gear set and from there on from my first scene nili i gave myself 100 so that's how i found myself now interacting with akina ba na kaivi set manze nilikuwa na kaivi na na govi nilikuwa na master the whole day niko hivi tu nimezuba na na ba the whole day tunamwangalia mm-hmm. yani nilikuwa guy mi nafanya nini huku manze mm-hmm. cuz hiyo ni letter into court na kids festival ai ai u nilikuwa na jua tu machachari ilikuwa nini ati atuni almasi nini then with time tu nika come to realize by the way i have if nimeji but a great position mm-hmm. then i totally have this is what i want to do i have the potential to be as good as them mm-hmm. so i kept on pushing mm-hmm. yeah okay na the journey likuwa je unajua when you mtoi you have to master the script yeah. na lazima bado you balance with studies yeah ilikuwa hard cuz at the same time cuz your time coach is a ball sana mimi mm-hmm. sema kasi ngekuwa na acting ngekuwa coach is a ball mm-hmm. so time coach is a ball sana nilikuwa academy na ito express soccer ilikuwa pale hillcrest mm-hmm kwa mke mtu wetu siku moja kaska tuwaze kadha songo acheza nga songo kwa passionate pia about football mm. na bado kuna chuo na ukiwa mtu wewe realize chuo but kuna hiyo pressure ya mkoro so mm. unajua bado lazima tu upass au juu mbona lazima upass but unajua tu lazima usome upass mm. but then kuna hiyo so ikafika point tulikuwa tuna shoot weekends and holidays mm-hmm. so ikafika point i couldn't play football study and do matachari so ikafika point ka ku make that decision mimi mm-hmm. nikasema ah manze ju ndo imejipa mimi nda kufa nayo mm-hmm. so it was very difficult because you f- una find yourself when you mtoi umefika chuo by the time i'm in class 7 8 adoleki anza kuingia wasaona ku treat cast chuo wase mm-hmm. like it's a whole new experience mm-hmm. and at the same time bado watu wanataka ku responsible mm-hmm. man i'm only 13 years 14 years but mapia zwangu ananiona ka ule mse mm. but teachers wanataka ku responsible like meaning you make noise ingekuwa different from the other person why when now na wewe ni mtoto bado no no like when you face already at that young age you make your pressure that there's some things you can't do mm. so I wasn't allowed to we weren't allowed to grow normally mm. we weren't allowed to make mistakes mm-hmm. unaona mm. cuz kuna hiyo point ya na vijana wa macha ama ni machachari na fanya kuwe kitu ngumu mm. ama kufanya kitu mimi ndakuwa circled out cuz mm. ni ule boy wa machachari ni ule nini so ilikuwa a lot of pressure cuz some people uh, uh, the teachers you know your elders they expect you to be responsible at a young age mm. so sit treat you as a normal child mm. you know like ufai kufanya hivi ufai kufanya hivi ufai kufanya hivi at the same time mimi ni mtoi bado na ikikam kwa usazili adole na kam you're a teenager a lot is happening so for us it was very intense it was very intense because you know come say to nambiwa you guys i'm fine to your high school of fake fanya hivyo fake fanya hivyo kifanya hivyo pigwe picha brand yako inachomeka you can lose your job so sikufanya vitu as a normal teenager unaona i was always always unaangalia your back and when you make that mistake criticism is so much unapata at a very young age you're stressed for nothing you know you're stressed because of making mistakes that you're supposed to make at that age do you have that yeah. incident maybe you did something na yani when you look around you they felt yeah, that ulikuwa yeah. sea sana but wewe kama mtoto you didn't understand yeah ilko ina happen kwanza ukiwa dole like kwenda event umeonekana umepiga picha mm. na kadem na mm. kwa big issue ama maybe ulienda kuna kitu uliandika uli, uli kwanza hiyo time facebook ndio ilikuwa imekamsa kwa mm. keni machachari kwa na tosh machachari mm. ba hivyo 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 mm. so me post kitu pale facebook like wewe tu una post as a young person mm. ume post maybe lyrics flani valga ama ume post to anything ama you've, you've done something mm. 
na kumkan nilipigiwa na sijui wase wangapi from productions ni nini ilikuwa noma so you post nini usiku siwezi ongelea hiyo ni mambo ya kitambo but that's okay. just an example another example ni unapata maybe nikiwata young like nikipatikana kwa makesi ka makesi za tudem sijui mm. umeandika letter ama kitu kama letter ma, but cause me for some reason nakumbuka kuna time nilikuwa napata ma letters kwa desk yangu mm. but kesi itakuwa yangu then me niko like na wewe ndo umeandikiwa eh hey, niko like but wanasema ni yani ukijana tu machari utondo unene unene mm. so basically and also just normal mistakes that teenagers make you know mm. normal mistakes that we make when we are young mm. eh, you know utu, like you kuchongo mtu normal tu ya mse yangu unaona mm. but for us it was very like for me inge happen times 10 unaona mm. like mode ya kuongelesha na amekujamia ile sana last u react in a way that mse mwingine ange react but for you ni you are rude mm. na mode wa kwanza kisha sema you are rude stuff from your day del profile you as a road student because mm. una jiona star and, and to be honest you are not in that mind space mm. so uliko unapata if me i thank cause nilikuwa na mamangu mwana alikuwa na nyeka in line a lot mm. uliko unapata if you don't have the mental capacity to handle that pressure mm. you end up getting depressed you end up doing things to piss people off mm. because you are like oh so i'm talking if and they fanya and you don't learn from your mistakes you just get more damaged because mm. you actually making that mistake intentionally mm. ku preview um say wrong like nyimi ni ai sa so i'm talking if any even unanione and i fanya unaona like tu ni vile tunasemanga ukiwaomia kitu na kaziwa ndo utaifanya na sometimes ni tuko a rebel mm. so if you're not mentally strong enough or you don't have a good support system mm. which often lean a lack especially for young actors mm. in this industry mm. wase wase wanakuwa depressed kwa industry what then why the hell can't you offer proper proper management proper guidance for young actors kama wase wazee wana wanakuwa depressed for real maselebu wengi tunaona online ni nini so ni imagine huo mtu hii mwenye ayuko emotionally mature ku handle your pressure niache so hiyo ndio ilikuwa the main thing like you, we had to figure a lot of things by ourselves we saw life very early kuna watu tulikuwa tunaona at a very young you we know, <laughs> grow up cuz ukiwa too set you will just have to grow up mm-hmm. what about mm. the society what are some of the pressure mlikuwa mnapokea from the society mkiwa hivyo watu wewe nyi hamu understand of course mtoto hata understand what's going on mm. like vitu mob to like venye tunasema kuna hiyo perfection ilikuwa plasma to chase unaona mm uko macha chari you have to be good at school to mm. ukimaliza uki chuo na grades mbaya utakuna mm. chekelea hiyo macha chari ndio unafanya usipass mm. unaona ama usipo understand like basically you just have to be perfect because unaonekana uko nje they take mm. you as a you're a, you're a reflection to society even though inasema anga mm. famous people often reflection to the society mm. but for us we are kids mm-hmm. so why will you put all that pressure to us mm. you know and we were very exposed me i say that mm. bluntly mm. our industry i could remember at say we are not yet to that level where saying you at least vitu zinaanza kuwa better but mm. at that time vitu kama management vitu kama hizo vitu kama mental health for artists they are not taken seriously in our industry mm. that's why people will troll someone who's de- an artist who's depressed and I make him out on social media mm. and even fellow artists will troll him yeah. and they'll be like ah umse umse anategemea tu watu but mm. really if you go to other industries cuz as an artist you exposed mm. people have entitlement to what you say to what you Maybe do why is it that not not actually as an artist i think it's everyone when you anafanya kitu yenye iko kwa mtandao like your blanket yote tell me that same as an entertainer mm. like people are entitled very you know na so imagine people being entitled to your life at a very young where would you so kulikuwa na hapo hadi ulikuwa na pato na chess vitu zingi wasa wengine hadi wali give up on acting due to pressure mm. yeah, wali pressure wa sana even by their own family members mm. their own extended family nini elder like ikitu inaku inaku waste nini nini focus na hii focus na hii mm. pata wengine wako campus they are depressed mm. unaona mm. unapata a lot of like when you tell me we have a lot of loopholes that as entertainers 
we we really need to we really need we really need to come up with uh, formulas and methods to actually take care of mm. young actors na mimi hiyo ndio kitu nasebanga because there are some things that would not want a young actor to go through that we went through mm -hmm. you know and that's why i'm saying if you aren't mentally strong if you aren't cause even for me there are some people in our set femio ilikuwa times 10 yangu mm, so yeah. i can imagine the pressure they were going through mm. so sometimes na tembea ngo ku nje nasikia so anaongea kusum say recently ule, someone opened up to people on, uh, about his financial issues and people were trolling him and people were going to build him a house mtu mwenye amesema i have a problem with addiction mm. with alcohol then you go give him money mm. how will you, how will money solve that thing take that person to rehab solve the issue first yeah. and that's the thing with most kenyans even human beings even society we use money to solve a lot of things and that's mm -hmm. the problem that's why we ka influencer ka entertainer ka content creator brand mm -hmm. do yote mm -hmm. but they don't want to control you and control they won't care yeah. deadline ni kesho they won't care adi adika leo na mkoro wako alikufa they won't care si tulikulipa mm -hmm. so that that's another aspect that i think as an artist if you're not careful mm -hmm. you really i'm not saying that they should care it's not their work to care yeah, sure. their work is to pay you and do the job mm -hmm. but as an artist you need to be very very careful with that like mm -hmm. mental health ya wasanii mm -hmm. na absorbing you uki realize too manze my fans ni my fans mm -hmm. na kuna fa like you uki realize au ni my fans na au ni family mm -hmm. uki were attached to your fans my fans kesho atamkwa sema wakupendi anymore mm -hmm. then uko depressed tu wakupendi anymore Uh, Bugi, from when you sound, do you yeah. feel like kukuwa famous msiaki wa mtoto somehow iko na some negative effects? Yeah, iko na negative effects. Hata mm. kuwa famous kwa mzima si uko na negative effects. Kuna yeah. vitu wawezi do, kuna vitu wawezi fanya. Uko na limitations yeah. more, you can't be yeah. like a normal person anymore. So, so adi kwa mtoto hii, kwanza kwa mtoto hii it's very juni easy hiyo hiyo. Si wote tulikuwa tuna feel kama. Tumekuja chuo kila msa na ku ongeleshe na sate ndio kila msa mekuti unaona <laughs> yeah, like, i love something that sometimes unajua sisi ni normal human being you'll find that maybe you're just having a bad day mm. then unapata na mse yeah na expect to pata na eu bambike perfection like kila mse hautawepe excuse like bugi alinibongesha vibaya yeah. bugi uko like msata kama bugi self self na wewe pengine uko na two stress zako mm. na ukikata yo self na kwa bugi ni mrude but huu msaki kama kuza eh bugi ni aje Eh hey, unaka uko down ni mbaya. Mm. Unaona? Sure. Eh hey, mwambie mzee Saima nzee niko na stress bro. Mm. We fit is feel cool. Unaona? Mm. But ndio nasema hiyo perfection hadi tukiwa watu hii atukupewa liwe ya ku grow. Mm. Atuku grow normal. Mimi naweza sema tu hivyo. Mm. So unless ulikuwa na good support system in terms of your family, in terms of uh, your friends, in terms even the guidance of people around set because mm -hmm. we tulikuwa na matron on set but that's not yet enough back home in school in nini what is also the industry doing to protect young actors you know those are the things we need to look at mm. you get because young actors wanna go through a lot of things and ni kitu mimi singetaka tena ko so nasema negative effects ziko mm. na zilikuwa mob because as a when him toy any time yako ku grow mm -hmm. so mistake last mo make at the same time you have to be perfect mm -hmm. so at a very young age already ukona na you can grow you always grow chasing perfection mm -hmm. so let's go to kuwa perfect mimi kan ilikuwa ni get your fame nikiwa 14 your time mm -hmm. na expect by the time niko 20 mm -hmm. nimeshinda oscar nimeshinda nini una realize uko 20 21 22 23 24 25 kwanza sasa ndio umerudi chini mm -hmm. you'll be depressed because mm -hmm. at that time when i was popping all you guys did was made me believe i can be perfect iki to it like you get So ukiamka then you realize ah hakuna mm. msana nobody cares about me anymore. Mm. Ile na kwa now down the narrow road. So that's why I'm saying like mental health is a very mental health for entertainers should be taken very seriously and every entertainer mm. should really look take some time me usema me take some time off from my craft samacha ni pomoe acha ni live mtu anaweza cheese unaweza fear wewe unajua ma pressure yeah. unaweza fear so pia wewe jitunge ka entertainer jitunge sana 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 mm -hmm. na maybe for any parent ama any 
sikazie mtoyo wako because me can say pia positives utaka mkoroso wale so usiseme ati negatives kwa mobu na kazi yomtoyo what i'm saying it's not bad the thing is you need more mechanisms to protect it when you have nikiwa na land hapa nimeacha hivyo bear ni kasta kwa watu wa kuja wa commodity land sita use and ita defense ni protect the same thing si ati sawa uambie mtoyo wako ati Uh, lola venye wale waliongea atutaki hapana mm-hmm. what i'm saying is let's come up with mechanisms to protect mm-hmm. that space mm-hmm. yeah okay so you feel like with the right with the right support system yeah, even yeah. if you are a kid yeah. everything itakuwa poa kwanza mimi sema mimi kama mimi nime learn a lot mimi sema niko na experience kwa 7 years ko industry unaona mm-hmm. but nikiwa mtoi hiyo tu kwa set nika mtoi sign kick comes nivene nimekuwa older mm-hmm. sasa inaanza ku produce my own shows naanza cause ni experience nili learn mm. from that age then ikiwa hiyo age i think the thing is i think most parents should really ukiwa mtu huyo mtu mtu huyo ako na a lot of passions you're mm-hmm. trying to figure yourself out mm-hmm. so i can say ukiona mtu huyo wako ako na a lot of interest in this thing mm-hmm. ada kama last last year alikuwa sema atakuwa footballer this year amekuwa act he push atapata balance yake mm-hmm. don't like just support because that's our age to figure ourselves out. Mm-hmm. So I think kama dhangu ange ni push ange sema si wewe ulikuwa unasema utakuwa footballer sasa umekuwa hii tena wewe soma. Mm-hmm. Wewe soma tu. Mm-hmm. Kange ni kazia. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But your times if I kwa na msimamo mimi ni mtu hii. Mm-hmm. But kama dhangu ange ni support kange niambia soma usiposoma mimi nitakukazia matatari. Mm-hmm. So alikuwa anitumia hiyo ka tool. Mm-hmm. At the end of the day ili nijenga mbaya. Mm-hmm. Ili nijenga mbaya cuz nilikuwa na hiyo discipline ya wa mm-hmm. akina fa na fa sikuwa na chakiti yote ingilie books mm. unaona so uh, can you never say man the same thing like it's a very it's a very it's a very interesting journey like in any come to talk about the sports come to talk about negative ziko mm. but the thing is attack you amze but is on negative zitakuwa mm. so the thing is not doing away with it the mm. thing is protecting that space coming up with mechanisms to actually mm-hmm. make this person cut a cut a blossom and whatever anataka kuwa mm. you have protected them mm-hmm. yeah okay what about the posi- positive aspect i'm sure ulikuwa na a good time to relate na watu wengi wenye walikuwa wako kwa industry watu wanajua more about the industry yeah. oh, positive aspects zilikuwa more ulikuwa na nili network nili get ku meet a lot of people in the industry watu sikuwa na pia me motivating even psychologically as a kid mm-hmm. when you see people like, when you see manze kwa hiyo kwa mtu huyu kwa namba 1 namba 2 hadi namba 3 una nice umepewa hiyo book na ruler imagine. so imagine when mtu huyu all your all your life umekuwa ki dream kwa actor then unajiona kwa tv mm. then unaenda siju una meet actor mgani mm. unaenda siju you nominate your award show unaenda like it was so much it gave me so much confidence in myself mm. and from the time nilianza machachari and the time as well anza kusema kini ni mkali 2013 2014 cuz you don't understand sama saka rakti angu ilikuwa imeanza kuchemka mm-hmm. 15 huko ili nipe so much confidence that i believe by the way i can do this mm-hmm. so that's one positivity mm-hmm. the fame the fame also the love from people and the motivation ili nipe so 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 much confidence mm-hmm. unaona mm-hmm. another thing ili nisaidia ni kuwa myself spoken and to speak my mind ukiwa tu kwa sasa tutajua mm-hmm. like you are confident even in yourself exactly. you know you say this you see this you do this you know you don't fear speaking your mind you know mm. peer set gives you discipline set tuko tunamkaka shule unamka mimi nilikuwa nishila ngata pick up time ya town is 6 am so na manisha lazima ni amke latest 5:30 i freshen up nini 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 mama ni drop by the time nilikuwa naingia form 1 mother alikuwa shaacha kuni drop hadi class 8 tulikuwa tunashikana na panda mat kutoka langata 5:45 am natembea hivi tau kutoka afya center hadi hilton peke yangu Si ati madhangu alikuwa anasema ati it's insecure is nini zi mm. nili grow up ili nisaidia ili ni machua pia mm. unaona mm. nilikuwa na shuka tu hivi mat na za hivi hood mm. si salimi mtu ni mambo na usisalimi mtu usisimame pale <laughs> mtu akikufanyia kis kis kimbia <laughs> sha 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 so hiyo ni positivity nyingine mm. discipline pia naamka ukifika set kuna matron mm. unaona kuna de- like kunaelewa kwa life by the way kuna kitu inaitwa discipline. Mm. Unaona? Ili nisaidia sana pia kwa discipline yenye pia nilia nilikam kwa apply kwa life yangu in future. Mm. Also kwa venye tumesema tu nilikuwa craft yangu when I was early mm. that right now 
naanza kufanya vitu zangu naanza ku employ unaona naanza kushikana na maboys wangu na piga shughuli zangu mm. so that's one thing that hiyo kitu ilianza kau jinga sasa hii ndio naona sasa hii ni my future hii ndio itani employ hii mm-hmm. ndio itanilisha hii ndio nita create opportunities for other young people out there mm-hmm. in the long run cause museum i'm not even close to where i want to be mm-hmm. you know so if it didn't start from there mm-hmm. if mamangu wange believe in me uh no me come out wanga wange believe in me from there singe kwa pale nimefika mm-hmm. na hiyo ndio inanipe confidence hadi sasa pale nimefika hadi tukiwa na hizi challenges zote na kaa gumu mm-hmm. cuz i know there's a long run can me come this far then definitely i can go that far mm-hmm. so positives ni mob sana mm-hmm. naweza sema okay na tukiuliza bugi wewe uli happen kutokea kwa like how many episodes um niki kamio 2012 nilifanya nilikuwa nafanya few apps hiyo character yetu ilikuwa Kenny Triza mm. so venye yeah. Kenny na Triza ile introduce you actually Triza ndo alikuwa the main Kenny alikuwa tu brother yake on the background mm. but since zangu mimi nilikuwa hapo script mm. ikifika kwa set na change lines na bonga sheng tu yangu nafanya tu freestyle yangu unafanya mm. vitu zingine nilikuwa unaona hapo nilikuwa na Jinven camera man alikuwa kama kama Leo alikuwa apenda since Kenny tu ninge invent kitu mm. sema lazima nichukue close up ya huu boy mm. La, yani walikuwa tu wanapenda So definitely hadith zile nilipata role si hata nilikuwa ni kwa level moja na kina bana govi hatu work my ass off mm. your writer mm. aseme oh boy ana perform unaona mm. so kwa ni kwa episode moja leo at first ni kwa episode ya this time nenda hadi miezi mbili safi sionekani <laughs> hadi mabest wako za kwani ulitolewa <laughs> shooting back to back back to 2015 16 17 cause niliacha 7 around 18 18 ikianza ndio nili niliacha matatari but by that there was a time ilikuwa back to back but pia ilikuwa process when it come to the system how to prove to these people that by the way inaweza kuwa the same level na these main actors sikukubali kukuwa tu as a supporting nilisema i'll work myself or ikiwa tatupa episode niko na scene yangu moja nitaipiga unaona ndio ikafika point na kumkwa na deni lifanywa my own episode nilistuka mm. unaona mm-hmm. like me na hiyo ndio ndio nakusema it's so much it gives you so much confidence as a talent mm. inakupush to the next inakupush to the next mm. so naweza sema eh around uh, from 2015 to 18 mm-hmm. 14 15 16 18 sa upon 17 kwa regular 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 okay. but even me by the time nilikuwa my state for like two years before he became a regular mm-hmm. you know oh, so it's yeah. a matter of working even, even more hard you need to work hard mm-hmm. cuz competition iko high utaingia hapo scene moja na baha baha kuosha live mm-hmm. na watu wataongelea baha aliperformio scene mm-hmm. mr rudy home na nikubali mm-hmm. tarudi nikipoa script the following morning nyo nani line ya baha nifikiria venye nitai counter nae mm-hmm. govi amepiga hii show unaona competition was here 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 they are there and you want to reach their level mm. you know yeah. yeah okay na sasa ikafika mahali umesema wewe on your on your case uliacha 2018 yeah, yeah. unajua you guys tulikuwa tumewazo ya mkiwa watu wii mkaanza ku grow sasa mshao kwa watu wakubwa but would love to know from you like what exactly happened um by the time to kufika 2017 nilianza ku realize a lot of things a lot of sapa ndo nilianza ku realize the negative side of the industry 